Dougie, it's SPFL Trust Trophy action tomorrow. Last season we obviously reached the quarter-finals of the competition. How important is it for yourself and, and for the team to, to try and do well again this season? So it's, it's always important, Gareth, any any game, any co competition that you do well. You know, and we're, and we're no different. You know, if, if the aim is to, to win it. You know, it's the same as everybody else. You, when you're in cup competition, you want to get as far as you can. And, and we're no different, you know, the last two years we've finished quarter-finals. Um, both teams that have put us out in the last two years have got to the final, so, um, yeah, we, we, we'd love to get there, but, again, tomorrow is going to be a, a difficult game um, against a, a decent team. Yeah, tomorrow it's a bit of a relative unknown, isn't it, coming up against Cowden, beat a, a team in the Lowland League at the moment. You know, how does anything change going into a game like this? Does preparation change at all coming up against a team, a team that we wouldn't usually face? Nothing changes. The same, same principles always, always matter. You know, we have to train well, regardless of who the, the club is or the team that is that we're playing or competition we're playing. Nothing for us changes. We prepare the same way as we train, prepare for any championship game. So it's been a good, good week training um, in preparation for a difficult game at a difficult venue. Um, you know the surroundings will be different to, to not what we're normally used to, um, but the players have to own that. You know they have to go there. I've stressed the, the importance of how beef will be using the game as, as a potential banana skin that we have to deal with. Um, we've had it earlier on in the League Cup campaign, going to East Fife, playing against Brecon City, etc. So um, the message has been relayed to them that we can't afford to to do that again like we did in the, the early part of the League Cup. And do you look at tomorrow's game as, as a chance to maybe look at changing the squad up at all? No. Um, at the end of the day, we, the players will play that deserve to play. Um, we have to continue that continuity. You know, the boys in the last four league games have been excellent. People will be sitting saying, yeah, but you've only got three points, but theoretically we should be on eight to ten, um, in my own opinion. Uh, but uh, we aren't. So, but I think in the terms of the the, the way we've played, the, the games we've played, the, the boys have been very good. So, they deserve their, their opportunity to keep the jersey. Um, you know, we're not taking cow and beef lightly, and we'll put out the strongest pro uh, squad possible to, to go and hopefully win the game. Yeah, and you know, coming into this season and, and the start of the season, there's been a lot said about how you know you're looking to change the play style a bit and and change the way that, that what you say, what you play. You were Twelve games and, and now across all competitions, how pleased are you been with, with some of the performances that you've seen from the boys? Yeah, listen, there've been some some very good performances and there've been some very poor performances. But I think um, the biggest thing is 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 trying to gel them as quickly as possible. I think the early part of the the League Cup campaign was for me the poor performances or or poorer results. Um, certainly coming into the last couple of weeks the boys are starting to to grow into what we're asking them to do and I think you can see that. Um, albeit last Saturday was was disappointing in the outcome of the result, but I think the performance was very good. And just finally as well, it's been a summer with a big transition in, in terms of players you know coming and going. How pleased have you been with the, the business that's been done so far? Yeah, really, really pleased. Um, as a manager, you're always looking to add. Um, unfortunately, we don't have have that um, scope to do that. Um, but again, I would like to reiterate the the thanks to the the board and the chairman for allowing um, an increase in the budget this year from the previous two and a bit years I've been here. So, on that front, pleasing. Um, but again, it's always a difficult league. Um, to, to to participate in the teams are evenly matched, um, but obviously it's uh, SPL trust tomorrow. We want to we want to progress and we make sure tomorrow come end the end of play that we're in the next round.